A pensioner accused of murdering Lady in the Lake, Shawnee Warren in 1987, raped a girl of 14 six years earlier, a court heard today. Donald Robertson admitted raping the girl in October 1981. As well as being on trial for Shawnee's killing, he is also accused of raping a girl of 16 in July 1981. Prosecutor John Price QC said the first assault was relevant as it had similarities to the alleged attacks on Shawnee, 26, and the other teenager. He told the court, the only thing in common between them, it is submitted, is that the man who abducted and raped, the 16-year-old, is alleged to be the same man who, six years later, the prosecution says, sexually assaulted, restrained, gagged and murdered Ms. Warren. Shawnee Warren's body was found in a lake, image, PA. The 16-year-old from SLU, Burks, told police she had been attacked while walking home. She said, I screamed and ran into the road. I was crouched down and was. He said, don't scream, don't scream. I've got a knife and I'll kill you. I believed him. Reading Crown Court heard how she was then led to a nearby wood and raped. Robertson allegedly told her before the attack, you'd better please me or you won't see anyone again. The lake where her body was found, image, Graham Trot, ANL, Rex, Shuttershock. He was arrested the day after on suspicion of rape and agreed to take part in an ID parade. But the girl failed to pick him out. Jurors heard she later told officers, I think he was there. But it was not sufficient and Robertson was released. Four months later he raped the 14-year-old in nearby bushes while threatening her with a broken bottle. On Easter weekend in 1987, Shawnee's body was found by a dog walker in Taplow Lake, Bucks, not far from her home in Stoke Poges. A jump lead bound her hands behind her back and a tow rope around her ankles. A ligature mark on her neck showed a knot mark where it had been tightened. A pathologist said that as the limb ties were loose, she may have taken her own life. But 33 years later tests found traces of Robertson's semen on a gag used in her mouth, jurors heard. Last year, his semen was also found on the underwear of his rape accuser from 1981. He denies murdering Shawnee and raping the 16-year-old. The trial continues. Read more. Police refuse to give up hope Leah Croucher is alive three years after teen vanished. Read more. Husband's chilling messages to mistress before killing his pregnant wife with a mallet.